A victory over the so-called Islamic State has been declared in the Iraqi city of Mosul. The prime minister of Iraq arrived in the northern city on Sunday to make the announcement and congratulate troops. With more on this and other news around the world, we turn to Arnoir Aram. Aram, this proclaimed victory comes about three years since ISIS leader made a self-declared caliphate there. How significant is this victory? Well, Gia, we should note that this is more of a symbolic win and not a complete victory. There are remnants of IS still fighting on in a tiny area of the old city, and there are also other towns in which IS has a strong presence where the fighting will continue for some time. But this is enough for the Iraqi government to say it has recaptured Mosul, which has seen intense fighting for about nine months now between the jihadists and Iraqi forces, along with U.S.-led airstrikes. Uh, Al Abadi's arrival in the city formally marks the liberation of the city where the IS leader made his first and only public appearance. It is also where the jihadists proved a real threat in the region by being one of the main entry points for foreign recruits. The Iraqi Prime Minister is congratulating the armed forces and is due to give a speech formally declaring triumph. Nearly two and a half million people in Mosul have fallen victim to IS horrors since 2014 with public beheadings, gay men being thrown from buildings, and people who didn't practice Islamic rituals being imprisoned. Now Baghdad will make efforts to restore services and infrastructure in the city and allow many residents who had fled to come back and return to their normal lives.